Okay, so this is the test with my new mic. So let's let's see what happens here. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the character creation stuff. It, okay, sucks. Freaking, I'm sick of sick of screwing with my mic. Let's see what the yeah. I had to get a new mic. My headphones broke. So like I don't know. Apparently, I have to yell with this mic. We'll see what happens. Let's see. So it's gonna be this character creation stuff, right? I'm gonna run through this stuff. Okay, let's see here. Uh, Britain, why not? Let's do it. So it's custom class, right? Custom class. Okay, the only thing you guys need to worry about with this part is what spells go with what school. That's the only trouble you're going to have. Everything else is self-explanatory. So, like, you look it up at on the Elder Scrolls. What is it? Unofficial Elder Scrolls pages. It's got that, right? You're going to have to find what spell you need to raise this skill. Like for alteration, I think it's like, I don't know, what is it? I think I use light or something like that or something. Uh, what, what is alteration? See, like, uh, I don't remember. Like destruction is pretty simple. That's like fireball, right? You just create a weak fireball spell and it's, you're just going to get, you're just going to get skill. Illusion is like invisibility, the light spell. That's what I'm talking about, so. Just a heads up, and let's do this. Advantages, disadvantages. I've never done this, and there's lots of stuff here. And from what I understand, this stuff works, right? So let's run through this r stuff real quick. Acute hearing. You, you can hear stuff in the dungeons better, right? That's all it does. Okay, you can hear stuff better. Adrenaline rush. When you're fixing to die, you get like a slight buff. I don't know what's, what it's for, like what it goes to, but it gives you a slight buff so you... So, like, the survivability factor, it's a bit, it's, it's higher, right? Athleticism. This means you can run faster without passing out, right? Like, you, you last longer by being awake, right? Athleticism. It, make, it, it might even give a buff to some of your skills. I just know, like, you, your longevity is improved, right? With athleticism. Bonus to hit. Pretty self-explanatory, right? Makes you hit this stuff easier. Let's see what else. Immunity, same thing. You're immune to disease. You're immune to magic. Whatever. Whatever you pick, right? Go back. Increase majory. <coughs> Increase majory. Now, I always pick uh, some kind of iteration of this, but there's several. So, like, if you want to play a supreme mage character, that's it. You just got to adjust. Like, see this? Watch this. See that little sword? See, so you're going to have to adjust stuff because the higher this thing is above this, the slower you're going to level, right? Plus, you got this to think about, see? So, you've got to adjust some stuff. You're going to have to adjust some stuff. So, I'll leave that. I'll leave what I picked, right? That one. Okay, rapid healing. So, this is when you're sleeping. That's what it means. It's, it, you're not going to sit there and heal just standing there you gotta rest it makes you heal faster right that's all it does and it actually works like you'll 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 be done with resting quicker <coughs> excuse me okay so regenerate health this is what a lot of people are gonna want but it's kind of useless because it's like it's like a hit point every real world world minute so like you're gonna you know you're gonna be sitting there and you're gonna pass out because you're exhausted because you're trying to you're trying to regenerate hit points like it it does have an effect but if you're constantly fighting, you're not going to notice that much because it's not that much hit points. And your stamina still drains, so you're going to have to sleep it anyway. So, like, it's useful, but it's not as useful as it seems like it would be. Like, you can't sit there and play f for, like, 30 days without resting because you get rapid healing. You know, you gotta you got to rest because you've got no stamina. And if you're healing stamina with magic, then you have no magic. So you're going to have to rest. You know, it's just... It just it just you just heal standing there a bit faster. Like there's none of that in classics. So if you wanna if you wanna just slowly heal, but it's pretty slow. Like I'm saying, you're not gonna sit there and say I'm gonna heal because you'll just be standing there for like ten minutes. You know, nobody wants to do that, right? Resistance, pretty self-explanatory. It's just like a weaker version of critical weakness, right? You're resistant to disease. It's it's pretty simple. Spell absorption, it was, that's the one I always pick, right? It's got several several ones you can pick. This is, now depending on what you pick, it's going to be, see that? It's going to be more, right? So, like, just, 
I always pick the general, and you can mess with it. See, see that? Like, see like this? Look, I got 16 hit points for level. So to to make it level in a timely fashion, I need to bring this sword down, right? So let's do that. How you do that? Adv disadvantage, right? You're doing the opposite. See, this one's hooking your dude up. This one's screwing him up, right? That's what's cool about Daggerfall. You can do that. Like, it's not... None of this shit is built in like the Elder, the later Elder Scrolls games. Like, you, you're you picking this stuff yourself. Like, it, they did dumb this stuff down. It's dumbed down. Like, they're... All of them. Like, it looks pretty, but it's not... It's like, if you like R RPGs... Skyrim and an RPG, really. It's like a it's like a bare bones RPG, right? It is, dude. Like it is. The skill, everything is funky. Like everything is freaking funky in that game. It's like an action game with RPG elements. That's what t people should call Skyrim, because that's what it is. It's an action game with RPG elements. This shit is RPG right here. You're doing all this stuff, and it may not even work. Have you ever played a character th in Skyrim that that didn't work? I don't think it's possible. Like, you just become a sneaky mage. That's it. You're like an assassin with magic and a bow. Like, tell me tell me so many... Like, who didn't play the game with a bow? I want to know. Like, everybody did. Everybody is a sneaky friggin' archer. It's just... Like, how could they... Eh, I'm, I'm going to stop. I'm stopping. I'm going to stop before I start. Okay, so we've got critical weakness. Opposite of... Oppos oh, yeah. Critical weakness. Opposite of immunity, right? Same thing. But that's the opposite. Damage. So this is always going to happen. Like if it's sunlight, you're always going to take damage. This is like if you're a vampire, right? Holy places like the temples, you're going to get hurt. It'll s just slowly drain your hit points, right? Now this is going to drain your magic. So all this does is if it's dark, you're going to have less mag. You're going to have a, a smaller mana pool. It just reduces your mana pool. That's all it does. It doesn't make the spells harder to cast. It just gives you less mana to cast with, right? That's all that does, right? So, like, it's it's doable, but it's it, you. If it's nighttime or you're in a dungeon, you're gonna have less mana. So I don't see why anybody would pick it, because you know? it's it's and it's 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 the current mana. It's not the max mana. So like, if you have mana potions, you can you can get the mana. It's just if you rest, it's not gonna be there, right? That's what it is. Let's see, uh, that's darkness power. Forbidden armor type. It's pretty self-explanatory. You can't use it, right? Let's see, material, same thing. You can't use it. And the better this stuff is, the more of an effect there is. Like, check it out. Let's see, so we'll pick Adam and see him. See that? Watch the sword, right? See that? Watch this. Forbidden material. We'll pick steel. Wow, silver is, silver is quite a bit. Forbidden material. I always pick orcish. Man, maybe they're all the same. I don't know. That's weird. Like I thought, I thought this was interesting. Yeah, that will look, that looks about right. Okay, so you get that shield types the same thing. Can't use buckler. Can't use kite. Stuff like that, right? Okay, exit that weaponry. Same exact thing. Now this is gonna. If you pick this, it's gonna cut you off from using whatever weapon you have. So like, if you find a Diedrich shortbow, and you're like, sweet, I want to use it, but then you forgot you picked this at the start of the game, like you'll screw yourself. So when you pick this, just be ready to to like you know what you want to do. I want to be a dude who uses long blades. So just like you can pick axe. It's doable, right? That's what that is. Okay, so this is this means you cannot regenerate your spell points. Like I thought, there was different selections for that. Maybe not. Yeah, that means you have to like when you rest, you don't get hit points. The only way to, or magic points. The only way to get magic or mana is to absorb it or drink potions. Right. That's the only way. If you pick that, that's it. That's for like the I think it's the sorcerer. He can't regen mag magic in classic. So. <coughs> like you get it, you, you're, you're gonna have to absorb magic, which that's part of his skill set, right? He he comes with that. Okay, light power magic, same as dark power, but it's in the light. Like if it's, it, oh wait, what? That's darkness. Yeah. Oh, so it's opposite. See, so if it's dark, you can't cast, right? So let that's just gonna make you have less mana. And this one, I'm assuming, it's going to make you have zero, right? I've never picked it, but I'm assuming that's what it does. 
So it's opposite. Light powered, you can't cast in dark spaces. Dark powered, you can't cast when it's light. Light, right? When it's daytime, right? See, and it wor it's in dungeons too. Like if you're in a dungeon, this stuff is gonna this stuff is gonna kick in. Dungeon is dark. It's just how it is. I don't think it's inside the houses. Inside houses, it goes by if it's daytime or nighttime. Let's see, uh, low tolerance. Like this is a this is this is a a weaker version of of what is it? Critical weakness, right? It's the same thing. It's just a little bit. Yeah, it's just a little bit less. So let's let's try to even this. Let's try and even this thing out. Like I always pick sh uh, what is it? Frost because no, there's only a couple of things that have frost. And by the time you're fighting the frost eaters, you got stuff, so you don't have to worry about it. Phobia, that means you when you fight these things, it's harder. Like, you get like a minus five to hit or something like that. I always pick Deidre's. Because I just do. Low tolerance to disease. Like, another thing about this is if you're going to be a werewolf anyways, you can pick critical weakness to disease. Because when you get a disease, you're just going to be immune to it. So, it'll cancel that out. So, you can mess with this stuff. And you have this. But then when you get the disease, right, which you want, right? It's not going to matter. So, like, that's what people do in classic. Like, it's a, it's a doable thing. Like, you can you can pick stuff when you're creating your guy, and then in the game you can you can like what bypass it by whatever whatever we're talking about. Like uh, with the with lycanthropy or vampirism, it's the same thing. They're immune to stuff. So, let's see what else. Yeah, that's it. Phobia, low tolerance. Yeah, like you should get it. Let's see what else, because I'm trying to, I'm trying to show you guys this, this dagger stuff and how you can mess with this stuff. Yeah, see, here we go. Nope, I don't want that. Uh, phobia, get that right. Low tolerance, critical weakness, man, what's up? Yeah, I need to, I need to change that. Let's see, low tolerance to... Oh, it's the same. Okay, so let's do this. Armor type. I never use chain. I never use orcish. I never use... I sometimes use axe, but I've been picking it because I like the sword. See, now i still got to do more if I want this thing to be even, right? See, that's what we're talking about here. Weaponry. Let's... What is it? It'll go hand to hand. See? There we go. Even. So... Every level, I'm gonna get six hit points plus whatever my my endurance is, right? So let's let's mess with this some more. This is the character the character creation stuff, right? So I always mess with this part, the the will and the personality because, like you'll see this personality just makes it to where you can talk to people. Will is like your spell resistance, how good you are at resist. Oops, wrong way. How good you are at resisting spells, so. Like, I don't really care about it because I got that spell absorption, so I just, I can do whatever I want. Like, and besides, when you start rolling your character up, it's not going to be 10, it's going to be above that. So, like, like you got you got a bit of leeway. But you're doing this because you want to do this, right? So, when you're, when you're rolling your character, it's going to start with that. It's going to start with 70, right? Since I got that 3 times int in spell points, that's 70 times 3. That's what? That's 150... That's that's like friggin' two hundred and something hit po uh, spell points right there. So like you, you kind of want to mess with this. This is what you need to hit stuff, right? You need agility to hit shit. Strength, you do more damage, right? You can carry more stuff. All that does is give you more hit points. Like I'm pretty sure that's all it does. I don't think there's any skill checks that have intelligence. Willpower is resisting spells, right? Agility is how like how good you are at hitting stuff, right? And climbing. Like, I think climbing goes, like, climbing, swimming, stuff like that has to do with this. Like, like the, the actual climbing, not, not how fast you're climbing, but, like, your actual climbing ability. This is for your hit points, right? So, like, if it's, it's, w it's one extra p hit point for every 10 above 50, right? So, right now, it's zero extra hit points, right? Now, it's one extra hit point. So, every time I level... 
right? You got to pay. You got to remember that shit, right? You got to remember how much your point your points you're supposed to get when you level. Like you should write that down because when you're sixteenth level, you may not remember what you picked, right? It's always going to be this plus your endurance modifier. Now, if you have magic items, it's going to affect that. Like if you say you have something that increases your endurance, it's going to give you more hit points on level up. So you could have a ring that, that adds 20 endurance, and every time you level up, you put that thing on, it's going to give you two extra hit points, and then take it back off, right? Put whatever else you want, but, but that's how it is. If your endurance is above, like, the, the, the 10 number it needs to be, you're going to get the extra hit points. And it, it, even if you have an ag magic item, it's gonna, you're going to get it, right? So like I said, just, just keep a ring that's got plus endurance, and when you level, just put it on, and you'll get hooked up. Okay, speed. Right, so I'm not gonna mess with this shit. Let's see what else. Yeah, I need to mess with some stuff. Yeah, let's do this because I like personality. Yeah, I'm just I'm just showing you guys stuff. Uh, what else? What else? Yeah, let's do this. Yeah, see. So so see this. See what I'm doing here. So when I start making my character. It's going to start with this, and when you're rolling this stuff, it's just going to go up, right? Everything's even, average, right? I'm getting 60 points, 60 hit points a level, done, right? Oh, let's call it something funny. Boob head. Why not, right? Screw it. Oh, damn. Hey, you know what I'm thinking about? That's right. Sorry, ladies. It is what it is. Oh, forget about that. Yeah, let's just, let's just run through this. I don't care. Like, I don't even care. Now, this, these things you're picking, these are gonna, uh, these are gonna change what you, like, when you're, when you're, because they're, like, you'll see. Come on, man, what are you doing? Like, when you, when you start rolling your, creating your character, you get to answer questions. Now, what you pick here is gonna determine what questions are asked, right? You'll see this. Okay, so we got that. Let's do this. Uh, you can mess with this. You can mess with every single thing. Who likes you? Who doesn't like you? Like, see that? It's got to be even. See that? And we'll, we'll, we'll be jerks to the nobility. Like, screw it. I don't care. And the underworld. They're a bunch of assholes. Let's... Right, so I got two extra. One, two, right? Now, if you want to get... Like, I don't think this affects selling stuff. I think it affects quests, right? Selling stuff is determined by... What is it? The mercantile skill, right? This just affects how they react to you. Like, it's not going to change the prices. It's going to change if they even talk to you. If they talk to you, if they give you a quest, stuff like that. That's what that is. It's not going to make the shop cheaper. That's what mercantile is for, right? Okay, we're done. His class is called Boobhead. And this is the, the picking stuff. So you're going to have to go on the Elder Scrolls, unofficial Elder Scrolls wiki, right? And see what this stuff does. Because I'm not going to go through it. But most of these things have something. Like this is going to give you a bonus in archery, right? Self-explanatory. Since I'm since I'm going for long played. Oops, I missed that one. Let's do it over. That will be a long played, right? Riches. Now this, this makes you friendly with certain people. I think this is for the peasants. Uh, that's probably for the rich people. Uh, it's probably for the... Uh, so there's so many damn factions. Like, but that's what this is. It's it's making you friendlier with these factions, right? You're just going to have to look at the... Look at the unofficial Elder Scrolls pages to see what they do, right? Dodging. Self-explanatory, right? It's just giving you skills, right? That's all it's doing. I always pick swimming, but it's not here. Yeah, what a pity. Okay, yeah, here it is. This is the one where... Like this, I think it makes you jump. That makes you a little, f I don't know what that does. That makes you climb better. This makes you, what is it? I think it's your hand-to-hand -hand skill. This one is swimming. I always pick that. All right, this is going to give you stuff when you start the game. What do you want? You want gold? You want book? I always pick a book because you can just sell this for more than 200 gold. So, And that's pretty self-explanatory. There's a bunch of them. Like, see, the thing is, is they're not all showing up because of the skills I picked, so... Like, depending on what skills you pick, different stuff is going to show up. That's how it works. Okay, look at this. Look at this. Right? It's pretty self-explanatory. Actually, this is kind of confusing. Yeah, that gives you point that, that makes you it harder to resist. But this one 
just drains your stamina. You get five less stamina, right? This one, it's like minus five to hit, so it's kind of different, right? This is this is minus five magic resistance, right? And this one, it's like the reaction. The reaction to when you're talking to people, it's minus five. So, like, it's kind of different, but like it's you get it. Here we go. More stuff for you. A desert arrow is no a book. You're familiar with who do you, who do want to be friends with, right? And it's not that much it's like five, so it's not going to really make a difference. And all it's going to do is make them not fight with you. They're not really your friends. They just don't attack you. I always pick dragons. Uh, what do you get? By an, so I picked this last time, but I didn't get the dagger, so I don't know what's up. We'll see what happens. Training with what? It's going to give you some more skills, of course. Did I just pick long blade? I hope so. You are intimate friends. This stuff apparently doesn't do anything. Look at the wiki. Like, I don't know, Daggerfall guys, if, if the Daggerfall Workshop dudes, if you can fix this, it doesn't, it, it doesn't do anything according to the, the unofficial Elder Scrolls pages, so, like, it seems like it would, right? Either you, you're friendlier with this faction, or maybe you get a skill that's associated with that, right? Maybe you get more mana, I don't know, but it seems like you could, something could be done, like, because it doesn't do anything now, so, maybe you can get something, I don't know, like a sword or... A dagger. I don't know. Who knows? Okay, so that's done. See, so remember how I switched the stuff? Well, that it got switched again. So there we go. Okay, we'll call him Fred. Fred. Freddy. I'll uh, just leave it at that. That's it. Okay, pick your face. All right, but you get it. We just went through the the custom class creator system. So all that stuff you should be able to get. And if the stuff you don't get, go look at the Elder S unofficial Elder Scrolls pages. It'll it'll explain a bit more. But like you should get what I said. Like it's not too hard. And the thing is, is is playing it and experiencing it for yourself is the fun part. So like, I recommend not using it. Like unless you really have to. Like which I do. I have to. So just a heads up. Okay, so remember they started at 70, right? This one started at, what was it, 30? This one is at 10, so let's roll. See what see what's happening? So it's it's close to 80, which is where I want it. And, like, to get it there, I'm going to need to get this high. But I also want this to not be too low, right? So, and as you can, as you can see, it started at 30, so it's already, it already gets hooked up. But that's what we're talking about here. Like, you're going for, through, you're going for a set, S number of skill points like your stats you want your stats to be at a certain spot like if you don't know figure it out like i already know what i want, I want 80 80 80 everything else whatever like everything else is 60 but this one and this one that's what i want like that's what i'm going for right it's a pretty good it's a pretty good build right here if you can start the game like this you're gonna be you're gonna be okay like you're gonna you're gonna do okay in the dungeon see that yeah uh, what's what's it gonna do yeah, see, it's not close enough. Because I need to get these up to 60. Right? And I can do it. You can do it. You just have to sit here and roll shit. Like it's, It'll take a while. It'll take a while. But you can do it. Let's see what I got. See? Um, almost. Almost. See? Now, you can almost do this because you're going to level up pretty quickly the first level. So, see how it's 50 and I wanted to get it to 60? Well, if I get six points that's that's half a 60 already so like i'm close but i can do better let's see if it saved my last roll yeah i had a pretty good roll last game so let's see if i get something good yeah uh, what i always do is i look at these two numbers this one get high this one unless you want to just scan this crap forever because it's a bit time consuming it is a bit time consuming like, i didn't know i was going to get a jilly 80 that's pretty freaking cool my other character is his max is seventy, so that's not gonna work. Oh, what's this? Nope. Nope. Yeah, see, because I want to get this, this, and this to sixty, right? It's got to be sixty before I start, a as well as the other stuff being where I want it. So, like, it's just what we're talking about, and right, that's what we're doing. Okay, is this it? It looks like this is it. Uh, maybe not. Uh, this could be it. Nope, it's not gonna work. Not gonna work. But like I could see. But you get what I'm saying, right? So, 
we're good. Like, it's good. I just have to sit there and roll some more. So I, I would naturally want to get this to 60 and start with everything at 60. And see that? That's not 10, right? That's not 30. So it's it still gets hooked up, right? So that's why you mess with that shit. You mess with it. And, like, if you don't like it, all you got to do is hit escape. And you get to go all the way back, right? So done, right? That was it. That was the character creation system because I was done. All I had to do left is roll that stuff. But, like, you get it. Let's do that one more time. And I'll just do it real quick. Real quick. I don't even have to pick anything. I don't have to pick anything. So I'm not actually going to play this guy. And then, then I'm going to go play, play the game. And check out some stuff. Like, I think I think um, my draw distance isn't too bad because the tr I got the tree mod on it. It works pretty good. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with this stuff. Oh! I hate this part. Boob. Oops. Yeah, it's called B. B. B is good. B is good. Let's just skip through this. Blah, we don't care. We don't care. Yeah, I just I just want to get back to that part. Right? Yep, see? It's quick, quick. Look, see I'm done. Oh, this part. Yeah, like your skills, you can you can buff these up. Right? Just Whatever you picked, you got like six on each. You know, what I suggest with this, th with this is is raise the ones that are the hardest to raise. Like dodging, that's hard to raise. So buff that stuff. Like out of these two, it would be alteration, right? Because all you got to do is hit stuff with these to make those raise. You got to have magic to have that to make that work. Plus, you have to have spells, right? And you have to have magic enough magic to be able to cast it, right? So. Always with the magic, if you got a selection, pick that. Okay, let's see here. That's it. That's it. Looks good. Bam, bam, bam. That's it. Yep, yeah, that's it. You can make it go, make it go faster, go slower. La, la, la. Whoops. Huh. Uh huh. Let's die. I just want to get killed. Screw it. Hey, what's up, dude? Screw out your head. Screw out your head. Like, look at that. That's my beautiful screenshot. I love it. Yeah, see. Wall Mashes version 2. Yeah, they get this. There's wilderness encounters for this now. Yeah, sure, why not? Ah, sure, why not? And it's going to tell me about the... Come on. Yes, I would. Yeah, this... This... this. Nope, I don't want it. That's a lot of startup. Yeah, the, the, what is it? Yeah, see that? I don't know how to stop that. Like, it's, it's probably all the mods, but it does it. So let's see what I was going to say. Yeah, let's see, let's see. Because I think the leveling up is kind of skewered in this version. Like, in Classic, you level up pretty quickly, but that's not the case. And the wilderness encounters, the stuff spawns inside. Like, it spawns in the dungeon. So, like, you'll be resting, and it'll say you come across a campsite. Like, let's see what if it'll work. I just want to show you that stuff. So, like, it's doing that. Now, this is just classic Daggerfall. See? It's just spawning stuff. Yeah, he's probably going to die. Hey, he's dead. Like, this guy sucks so bad. Laters! It was nice knowing you. I don't care. Kill me! Kill me! Yeah, so that's it, dude. Okay. Let's go on to the game proper. Like, you guys saw some stuff. I showed you. So, like, it should be... It should be no surprise. Like, you're gonna have to look at that Elder Scrolls unofficial wiki. Like, you should go through that and learn all that. Like, there's tons of stuff in this game. This is a hardcore RPG. It's not... It's not... It's not like a, a imitation action... Ar uh, action game that's acting like an RPG like Skyrim is like oops okay yes I know I quit on accident it's cool like oops okay let's do some more stuff so I'm gonna play I'm gonna go into my game and and check this stuff out. there's some new stuff in here let's go through this so you can see this this, this I've had this forever like it's never changed so and it still works like way to go you guys Distant terrain. This is this is quite. It's kind of old. Like it, they haven't been updated. It still works. So, 
All this stuff has been updated. There's a new version out, so like it's pretty sweet actually. Like I had to go all through my texture folder to get this stuff to look good because this dream thing is so cool. Like I'm telling you, I don't know what they did, but it's cool. And, it, and again, these aren't my mods. These are things other people made. I'm not claiming I'm making these stuff, you guys. This is King of Worms and whoever else on the forums is helping them. They made it a mod. So it's not, it's no longer a texture pack. It's its, its own self-contained mod, right? Just like all these things. Like I'm just showing you these things. They're not mine. I did not make them, right? Okay, so we've got Enhanced Sky. This one has not been updated in a while. This one is brand new, right? Look at this. You see that? Watch that. Look at that. Look. Treasure piles are now... We got 3D treasure piles, okay? Like, you guys are gonna freak. It's it's freaking awesome. This, I, I don't know who Alexander Zig is, but, like, he's doing some amazing stuff. I love, I love his stuff, dude. Like, I don't know if I was a jerk before, but yeah, I was just a douchebag. But this stuff is good. Like his stuff, I don't know what it is, but he if there's a bug in his stuff, he just fixes it. Like he's, he's been here for a couple of years doing stuff. So he just goes away and comes back. And like it's pretty awesome, dude. Like what this dude's doing. Okay, let's see here. This one has not been updated, but it still works. This one has not been updated, but it still works. This one has not been updated, it still works. This one is kind of new. But it works. This one is brand new, and I love it. But it's a bit laggy. This one hasn't been updated in a in a bit, but it still works. So, like that's my that's my mod list. Like I took some of these things out. I don't like the menus because they're too pretty. Like they're just too pretty. Like you guys can use them. I just don't like it. It's just a pretty. It's, it's, that's all it is. Just my preference. So right? I'm just into classic. The classic look. So I don't think anything's changed with this. Let's see here. I was trying to find out because there's more than one 1080p setting, and I don't want, know what the difference is. Like if it's frame per sec, but because there's nothing. Like I asked up there. Like I hope we get an answer. We'll see what happens. Yeah, nothing's changed. Nothing's changed. So like if if you want to play with without mods and you still got those things installed, you don't have to actually take them out. Just just click these things, right? It'll turn all that stuff off. Okay. Eh, nothing changed, nothing changed. Okay, we're done. We're done. We're done with the launcher stuff. Let's let's play this game. Yeah, it's not it pretty much plays the same, but all the all this stuff that's been going on for all this time, it's like under the hood stuff. Bug fixes, like if you didn't play classic, you're you're not gonna notice this stuff. So let's see. Uh, I'll I'll check out some treasure piles. Yeah, I gotta check out the trees too. I gotta load that dude up. I've got, yeah, if, I, if you can't hear me, I'm sorry. I had to get a new mic. Like, it, this is as loud as it gets. Like, it's as good as it gets, right? So, like, we'll see what happens. I can hear myself in the other one, so. Like, if you guys can't hear it, just let me know. Like, I know some people have trouble with that stuff, so. It's important to me, but, like, I can hear it, so. I just have to be, I just have to be loud. Okay, let's check out the treasure piles. Okay, here we go. Oh. Nope, I don't want that. Yeah, I do want it. Okay, let's... Let's drop this. Okay, right. Check it out. Look. Look at that. That's the Alexander Zig thing. Like, and it's not just that. Like, look. There's tons of them. Like, look at all this stuff. He modded the friggin' sprites for the treasure piles into 3D objects. Like, check it out. Look at that. Tons of stuff, dude. There's like one that's not done so far. I found one. Like, look at that. That's freaking cool looking. <clears throat> Bravo, dude. Bravo. Like, I like it. Like, I don't know who this dude is, but he's got skill. That's freaking cool. Look at that. Ooh, I haven't seen this one. Like, check that out, dude. That looks like it. Why can't I pick you up? Okay, I can't pick it up. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I guess I'll just... In the wrong place. We're looking at it. Hmm. Interesting. It's like Ford. Weird. Yeah, it looks like the looks like the treasure boxes. Huh. Yeah, see. If I click on it, I have to go left. I don't know. Interesting. Ooh, there's another one. What? Dude, that's cool. So like I got a boat, so I can fill my boat up with this stuff. 
Like, that's what we're talking about, guys. Like, just your, just for fun. It's like, they just did it. Like, that's so cool, dude. That is so cool. I love these guys. I freaking love these guys. Okay. Next. Yeah, where's the one I haven't seen? Like, look at that. It's pretty, too. I mean, it's a bit stylized, but, like, it fits, right? Like, check it out, dude. That's freaking sweet. Just like that. Yeah, see, that's not done. Nah, it's probably... I think it just has to do with the Unity. Something with the Unity. He's just getting assets and putting them in here. Like, it seems like, like that's what it is, right? So some of them, there's nothing for it. Yeah. But I don't know. Unless he made this stuff. Like, which... Who knows? Like, I don't know how that stuff works, but... It's working. Let's see next. Like, look at all this stuff, dude. Look at all that. He went through all that stuff and made it look like... That's some, that's some work. Thank you, dude. Thank you. Like, he hooked us up. Come on, man. Where's my bag? Here we go. Okay, where's the other thing that I know? It's not... Yeah, it looks pretty, too. Looks really... Yeah, you're gonna freak out. He did lots of stuff. It's pretty nice. And he adjusted to some of the stuff that's been done. Is that it? I think that's it. Yeah, there it is. Okay, that's the last thing that's not done. So, just... Just, like, that's three things that aren't done, right? We got... What is it? So let's take note, it's going to be this thing, right? This thing, and that, whatever that thing is. So, like, I'm left clicking. If I right click, it just goes back. So, like, it's just, dude, they're, they're, they just hooked the stuff up before they even released it. It's not like they just released it and said that's good enough. It's got functionality. You can go forward and backwards by left clicking and right clicking. It's <laughs> They just did it. Like, these dudes play games, they know what's up. Like, anybody who's played games, they know what I'm talking about. Make this shit cool, right? Make it mo make it modern, make it functional, make it simple, make it work, right? These dudes are doing it. Okay, let's see. Let's go in a shop, because they did some stuff with the shops. And I want to show you guys this stuff. And then I'll load up my game with the trees. Okay, let's check this out. Look at this. He, he, remember? Remember the fountains used to glow? Look at that. Look at that. Like, is that pretty? Except, I mean, it floats, but, like, I don't even care about that. Like, look at that, dude. He, he messed with it. He messed with it. And that's not even, that's not even a cool thing. Like, he did some stuff. Like, let's go see. I don't think the clothing shells will change. We shall find out. Yep, he changed them. He changed these. I haven't seen him yet. <laughs> dude, that's crazy, dude. <laughs> Look at that. Like, I don't believe it. It's, da it's Daggerfall. Look. We got 3D shells, dude. What's up? Like, check it out. 3D shells, 3D treasures. Like, he adjusted some of the stuff because it was kind of funky, but, like, I never said anything. Like, he's ju he just did it. So, he's, he's going in here and checking the stuff out is what's happening. Like, that's what I'm trying to say. It's not like he's just releasing this this stuff. Like, you know, the, the companies we pay to make games, they just release this shit, and they're like, okay, we're done. Nope. Like, your shit's still funky. Like, these dudes make the industry look silly. I'm sorry. They do. Like, it's crazy. Like, I'm thinking these dudes are in the industry, but, like, I'm, that's, that's what's happening. They make, them, they make them look silly. Like, and I'm not even going to say anything. It, that's, what, that's what it is. Okay, let's go in here, because there's some... Where is that store? Like, there's a store. They got new store shelves and stuff. Like, it's freaking sweet. You're going to freak. I don't know. I don't think I showed it. I think I showed it in a screenshot. Where's the freaking general store, dude? Like, let's check all these places out. Because there's tons of stuff. Like, he... What is that? Ah. So, it looks like these... These animations that aren't treasure piles... Because that's just a sprite, and you can't interact with it. So these things, like, like, I think, oops, I think you should look at that and s try to find out what, like, I know, I could find this sprite, actually. Like, it's in my texture pack. Maybe I'll do that. Say, hey, do this sprite. That's it, right? Yeah, it looks like it. Yeah, so we got these. Yeah, I showed these a couple times, but I haven't talked about them. Like, check it out. 
That is freaking cool. Like, I like those things. You see them in dungeons and stuff. There's all sorts of new things like that. Like, uh, the little, little candles. Like, the skull. I think he redid the skulls and stuff. I don't know. Or, not the skulls, but those, those, some of those standing candles like that. Where is it? There it is. Yeah, see? Look at that. That's a new shelf. Like, check that out. Like, is that pretty? I think it's pretty. That's nice, dude. So we got the bag, we got the bags and stuff. Somebody was complaining, but like, dude, I like it. Nothing wrong with that. Like, do you really want it to look as close to classic as possible? Because classic didn't even have, there was nothing coming out of the shelf. Like, it was just a shelf. Like, I like it. I mean, I'm not saying what to do. I'm saying, <laughs> like, I'm not. This, everything is cool with me. Okay, so let's see. What else? Let's go to a temple, because I like checking out the temples. Mm, yeah, I'm going to have to look for stuff. Because it's quite a bit of stuff, dude. There's there's new stuff. But since it's like... Like, it's not all in one place. you got to look for the stuff, so... But, like, all the stuff that was, that was in here before is, is still is still the same thing. Okay, here we go. Like, there's different, there's different types of these. Like, we've seen this one, but there's another one, too. Like, there's those... There's like standing lanterns, like small standing lanterns. Like I'll see if I can find. I think it's at the, at the palace. I'll go there next. Let's just go. Man, really? I don't care. Who cares? Who freaking cares? Like I could make a spell to, heal endurance, but I'm not gonna save this game. Oh yeah, this. Look at that. Remember, remember this, guys. Like I know you guys have seen this. It's in dungeons too. Look, look at that. That's it. That's it now. Like, I know you guys know this. Like, you probably when people first see this thing in Classic, they're like, what is that? Oh, it's supposed to be a fountain. Okay. Well, look. Now it's a real fountain with water that does stuff. Like, that's freaking sweet. What's the grid stuff for? Hmm. What that is. Interesting. Okay, where's the freaking temple? There it is. Come on. That could want to pass out. I don't even care. I don't care. Like, these fountains just got better. Like, they float a little bit, but they do look better. Check it out. And you can't, there's, there's no blue stuff. Like, you could see them from, like, a mile away, just the blue, so. Mm. <coughs> let's see, let's see, let's see. I don't think anything new is here. I don't see anything new. Nothing. Oh, there it is. There it is. Look at that. That's freaking pretty, dude. Like, this is it. Fully modded Daggerfall. It's fully, fully modded. Like, s straight up, straight up major mods here. Okay, let's do the trees. Come on. Let's do the trees because we're crazy like that. Ooh. Ooh, it's freaking cool. Yeah, take a break. I played some games, mess around. Like, I've been busy, man. Screw it life like it's cool come on dude let's do it load up sucker yeah it's because that's cut it's because i got all this stuff it doesn't seem to lag too much like look runs pretty good and this is i don't think my view distance is maxed either so let's really did i walk in i guess i did let's go somewhere yeah i think i think it's fixing every night so i can't see shit I cannot see anything. We have a Arctic. Yeah, I'm still in Elysian Hills or whatever. Like, I found the dead zone. It's like a dead zone. It's just like nothing but dead trees. And, like, the... What is it? Or am I in Elysian Hills? Yeah, sure enough. Yeah, it was here. Because th I was looking for that... The Tomb of Los Andes, but... I can't find it. Like, all this part is a dead zone. There's, like, empty patches where there's no trees. They're like, it's just like a an open field. But, like, I, li I read the literature, and it didn't tell you exact. It didn't even tell you it's in this, it's in this friggin' province. It just says it's by, it's by this, these two places. It's by, it's by, what is it? Anticlare the city and some other place that I haven't found yet, so... Like, I don't know, I don't know where the freak it is. It's that, it's that hidden tomb of Los Andes. Which, it's not even supposed to be in the game, but, like, still. 
Like it seems like they were going to do something because there's a dead zone in that in that place. Like it's just like a place where there's nothing but dead trees. So like it, it looks like uh, they were planning something. They just never did it. So I don't know. Like I was looking for it, like a run or something, but there's nothing. So I don't know. You know, just just doing some research and. But, like, I couldn't find anything. So, like I said, there is a dead zone, and it's in Classic, too. So just go to Anticlare and, and go northeast, and you'll run into it. There's, like, patches where there's nothing there. There's, like, a big swath of land that's just it's just dead trees, de like rocks. It looks like a wasteland. So I don't know what the frig it is. But interesting, and it's the only I've only found it there so far in this game. And I've, been quite, I've been to quite a bit of places. So like I'm thinking there's something up with that. They were going to do something. They just never did it. Like, that's what I'm thinking. So, who knows? And so, you can see, it's, it's, I've got everything running with the tree mods. So, I, I'm assuming my draw distance just isn't that much because it runs pretty smooth. And it's going to bump when you cross in zones, especially if you come up to something like this. See? So, that's just how it is. Here we are, in the city. Like, with all this 3D stuff now. Like, everything, almost everything's freaking 3D. I think even to those posts, too. Like, there's posts and stuff. I've seen them, and they're like 3D now. Like, everything is just going 3D. It's just, you're just slowly doing it. Like, it's pretty sweet, actually. Like, all this is, this is from his stuff. There's the King of Worms thing, but thing is, is, is this thing is gonna be a less hardware intensive than the King of Worms stuff. That's just, it's just a fact. Like that's what's happening. So like, like I don't know, like the 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 texture things. It seems like that stuff's really dependent on what kind of stuff you have. Like, if you don't have a dedicated 3D card, you're not gonna, you're barely even gonna run this, the class, the basic Daggerfall Unity, like. If you if you got mods, it may not even run. So just something to think about, because it is Unity. Like I know it's Daggerfall, but it's it's this is using the Unity engine. So that's just what's happening. I'm trying to get. See, I think I haven't activated the qu that the tedious travel wilderness encounters. I don't know how to. Like it starts when you start a new game. Like if you pick the tedious trap or what is it the? I think it's warm ashes or something. I don't know what the hell it is. something. Yeah, it seems like it should just turn on because tedious travel unless unless it turns on when you like if it's associated with another quest because warm ashes you have to activate. So if it's it's associated with that, like I don't know because it's not working. So it it works in a new game you start, but like this game that I've already started, I don't, I don't know what's up. And like I asked, but. I'm trying to find out how to activate the thing. So hopefully I'll get an answer. So I want to turn it on for this dude. See, it would be, it would be going off. Like it'd say, you discovered a fireplace. You discovered a campsite. Do you wish to proceed? Right. So it's not working. And like it's it was having encounters in the in the dungeon too. So I don't know. Right, it probably needs some more work. But like I like it. It's just I don't know how to get the damn thing working. Like in a game that's already started, you know. So, just something with that. It should be daytime. Yep. It's, what is it, cloudy? I want it to be light. Let's change the weather. Set. Zero, right? I think it is. Here we go. Yeah, I don't like that song anyways. I just want to listen to peaceful music, or peaceful nature, and be able to see everything. I'll check that out. What was that? That tree. It's pretty cool. Mm, see, it's not lagging at all. I don't know what the freak, but like it was lagging big time before. Maybe it's because this is the actual live building. It's not. It's not made using GitHub. Like I don't know, but like it's. It still bumps a bit, but that's I guarantee you that's from the trees. But it doesn't seem to lag that that much. Like look. It's a bit. It's a bit. It's probably close to 30, I'm thinking. I'll have to check. Okay, let's see here. What am I doing? 
Should I go to a dungeon or something maybe? Go kill some stuff? I think I will. Show you how powerful I really am. Because my dude's pretty tough. And this dude's only like fourth level. Oh shit, never mind. <laughs> yeah, he's pretty godly. Damn, look at that. Dude's dude's buff. Yeah, look. That's my grass right there. I love my grass. I love my grass. And it changes for the seasons too. Like it's pretty cool. And it's a dramatic change. Like it looks different. It looks like it's supposed to. Like I think the default grass it's a bit too colorful and bright. So And I like I like how I mess with the grass. It doesn't look it looks original. Like see, you can see that that the ambient occlusion doing that. Do you see how there's kind of a shadow under them? You see that? That's ambient occlusion. All the dark stuff around the grass, that's the ambient occlusion. You can see it. Like, I can see it. It's a bit hard, but if you play it without it, you'll notice it. Okay, what else? Let's go to a dungeon and kill something just for the frig of it. And I will end this because I'm cool like that. So you guys can get to see the whole picture. You get the whole friggin' picture. Yeah, you guys can hear me. I just have to yell. So that's it. I just have to friggin' be super loud. Woohoo, let's do this. Like, I like it. What? What the frick? Uh, I, I got stuck on something. Yeah, you get stuck on shit. There was, there's a log or something there. Like, it's a 3D log, too. That's what that was. Something stopped me. What was it? I wonder what that was. What is it? Hmm, I don't know. Screw it. Yeah, something was stopping me. Yeah, so you like you can slow down this thing if you push back. Like watch. See, I'm holding down. I'm holding back, so it goes slower, right? Push forward, it goes a bit faster. So it's the direction keys. Like when you're walking, look. See, I'm slowing it down. I'm slowing it down. So like, say you want to check something out, and you don't want to stop. Like, see, so just push back, right? And you can go left, right? So if you see, if I saw something on this hill, but I wasn't going to pass through it, push left. Push left. Slow down, right? Uh, you, you got, it's, it's, even though this thing is doing this, tedi this uh, tedious travel, you, you're still playing, right? It's just on an accelerated, accelerated time frame. Like, it's going faster. Everything you do is going faster. Like, you're still in here. Stuff is still going to spawn. Like, I wish I could get the dang wilderness encounters to work for this guy, but screw it. Like, I was, I put a question up there, hopefully somebody knows, because I don't know. I'm assuming you have to enter the quest in it, but who knows, we'll just have to wait and see. Is that something? Nothing? Okay, we have an invisible dungeon. Do we? Yep, we got an invisible dungeon here. That's what this is. Let's get this sucker to spawn. Yeah, see, remember what I said? When you start playing this thing, if this happens, you do a quick save, reload, and it's not going to happen again. Like, it's something with when you first load this game up. It's the first place you get to, and when you do this, right? Yeah, sure, I'll help you. Okay, if somebody wants to kill me. Come on, suckers, I got you. Okay, so let's do a quick save, right? Like this, it's ju it's done this since I started playing Daggerfall Unity. So I don't know what it is. It's not the mods, like I guarantee you, because it does it in Classic too. So I just did a save, right? That's how you do it. That's what you have to do. But once you do this and you're playing, it's, you're not going to see it again. Like every other place will show up. So I don't know if it's because I'm loading outside. See that? Because I saved it, and then I'm loading the game, right? Come on, load it. You gonna load the friggin' game? What's up, dude? I know I saved the shit. Save. Quick save. Quick load. What's up? Yeah, really? Like, what's up with that? It is F12. What the frick? Quick save. Quick load. Where is it? Quick save. Hmm. Yeah, you probably have to look at it from the from the readme or something but it, that's what it is it's supposed to be it's supposed to be f12 yeah i don't know what's up what's up it's not working 
Oh, my button's not broke. That's cool. Okay, let's let's fix this game right here. Look, I'm fixing it. I didn't have to do anything. Look, it's getting fixed. Watch this. So, like, that's what you do. You just do that. And like I said, I've seen it since I started playing this. That's like, what, three years? So, like, I don't know what it is. See, here we go. See this? This is what it was supposed to look like. Like, it's just, I don't know what it is. I tell you, it's not the mods. Like, I've tested it. It's not the mods. It's something, something, who knows what it is. But like, si since I was so far away, like, who knows? I don't know. But it's, it'll fix it. That'll fix it, and I'll never see it. So, let's check this out, dude. I love this shit. I freaking love it. Like, look at that. That is freaking sweet. Like, dude, I don't believe it. I don't believe it. Like, look at that, dude. This 20-something-year-old game. Right here. Just like that. Dude, it's so freaking cool. Dude, it looks cool, too. Look at that. The wolves and stuff. Ooh, I like it. Okay, let's go kill some stuff. You guys gotta freak out on this. Like, look. Yeah, I haven't seen that. Thank you. Thank you, dude. Look at that. Look at that, dude. Thank you. Like, you know how many times I changed the friggin' sprites for the skull lanterns and the shit don't work? Like, you change the sprites for the lights and this stuff messes up, so... Like, this is the way to go. Like, screw the sprite lights. Give us 3D lights, <laughs> right? It's just... Nobody wants to mess with it. Like, dude, it works and it looks cool. Like, that's crazy. I haven't seen that. Mm, 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 mm. I'm gonna take a picture of this for, for the for the freaking start, dude. That is freaking sweet. That is sweet. Look at that, and it's daytime, and it's gonna be scary at night. And shit. Mm, mm, mm. Like look at that modded texture. That's modded. That's King of Worms right there. So this loading screen is using the King of Worms mod. That's what's happening. Because all this stuff used to go in the textures folder, but now it's part of a mod, so... They did it. They just did it. Okay, I hope you can hear me, because I know it's kind of loud. Yeah, I'm, I'm friends with orcs, in the, with this guy, I think. I guess they don't like me. Screw you. I don't give a damn. Like, screw you, dude. You want some of this shit? Take it. Take it, baby. Look at that. Let's... Let's make some treasure piles here somewhere. Some treasure piles. Treasure piles. Because they're freaking sweet. We'll do those two chests because I want to see what they look like. The differences. That one. Yeah, we'll do this. Let's see what it looks like. Like, these chests are cool looking. I like them. Oh, wait. It was that one, right? Yes. Look, that's it. They, so, that's going to be my ship right here. I'm going to fill my ship up with this stuff. My boat. I'm going to fill my boat with that stuff. Look at that, dude. And you, you walk over them, too. They're actual 3D objects. You don't go through them. Like, that's going to be a new thing to get used to. Because that's how classic it is. You go through all, You walk through all the sprites. Like, check it out. What do you think? What do you think? Are you freaking? Freaking sweet. It's sweet. Like, this thing is almost done. It's just, I'm waiting for the lycanthropy. It's, it's like in the process. There's like a stub lycanthropy. Strub, stub lycanthropy disease in the GitHub stuff. Is there stuff on it? Look at his leg, dude. His legs have detail. What? What? I gotta check your pants out, bro. I'm sorry. Like, look at that. This is orcs have never looked so good, King of Worms. That's King of Worms right there. Look at that, dude. There's also other stuff. There's like a AI texture redo. They're doing that. I haven't even checked it out, but it's it's getting done. So there's more treasure piles. Like, see, all the treasure piles are are that. Like, that's freaking cool. Thank you. <laughs> you just did it. Like you snuck it in there. <laughs> I see it. I see that. I see that. You sneaky devil. What's up? Take that, sucker. Okay, I believe I'm done. Yeah, I see this dude. Like, if you can get this, good luck. If you can get this, this ebony, 
Like, because this is a full set of ebony right here. If you can find this in... Oh, shit. Maybe not. Yeah. I guess... Yeah, I'm not high enough level. Yeah, see? Ebony is so damn hard to find. Look. That's it. I got boots, and I think I got gloves. Nope. Like, that's it. I got boots. That's all I got is the boots. Like, that's how... And I think this is ebony. Yeah, see? Yeah, see? So I got three things of ebony. And my dude is level 11. And I've been playing... Like, look, we're, we're, come on, man. Yeah, see, so, like, I should be getting ebony. It's hard to find. It's hard to find. So, like, just a heads up. Yeah, see that? I haven't talked about this. We got location-based backgrounds. Like, this has been going on for a while. I just never talk about it. Like, see that? Watch this. Let's go. See, in Classic, it just shows, like, wh what race you are. It'll show, like, the background of that. It's not, it didn't show, like, where you're at. Unlike this. Like, look at that, dude. That is freaking cool. King of Worms roof. My floor. My wall. Like, that's sweet, dude. Well, it's not really mine, but... Yeah, none of this stuff is mine. I just messed with it. I didn't do any of this stuff. I just messed with it. Okay, we're going to check the background. See? I'm at a graveyard. Look at that. Let's go out of the graveyard and see what happens. Like, I don't think anybody's even noticed this. Nobody's talked about it, but that's what's up. Like, I've known about it. I just never talked about it. Like, that's what's up. We got location-based backgrounds. Check it out, dude. Like, that's three of them just there. Like, there's, there's like, the buildings and stuff. There's, like, the castles. I don't know. What do you think? I think it's freaking cool. And we shall look at my grass and just marvel because I spent like freaking a whole day messing with that stuff. So, And I'm proud of it. I like my grass. Be jealous, people. Be jealous. Like straight up. Or or mess with this stuff. It's freaking cool. Okay, that's pretty much it. What is it, made? I'm fixing to be 50-something. It's my birthday month, so... Uh, I don't, I think I'm going to be 53. Yeah, like, right? When you get to be 50, I don't even give a shit. Like, it's some 50 something. Who cares, right? Like, seriously, you guys want to pay attention to that stuff? Go for it. But that's what, that's the case, right? So, haha. <laughs> deal with it, people. All right, so that's it. Like, this, I'm going to play this thing. This is the current live build. I think it's the May 1st build with, with everything's been updated. Like I said, the only thing I can't get to work is, the only thing I can't get to work is, what is it? That wilderness encounter. It's like it works on a new game, but I can't get it to work with this one. So if I got to enter something to start the quest, I don't know what it is. So Just something. Just something. Like maybe I have to cancel the one that's active and reactivate it. Because, like I'm thinking, it is the, it's going to be hooked up with the, the friggin' Warm Ashes. Yeah, see. It'll say Warm Ashes Wilderness Encounters. But I don't see anything. So, like, maybe I have to look what... I gotta look the quest number for that thing, see? It's not working. Like it's not. I thought it would turn on automatically. It just doesn't. So, I don't know. I just have to go through my stuff some more. Ah, screw it. Okay, that's it for this one. If you guys like this, sorry it's been a while. Like, I've been doing stuff, so... But I'm still here checking stuff out. Like, what do you think? And, again, I don't think this is, this is with the view distance smacked, so... Like... I'm thinking when I bump it up, it's gonna lag because of the trees. But who knows? Like, it looks cool. Like, we still got... We still got trees. Alright, like, I'm, I wonder if this is the old version of that. Because I thought all the trees were done. Maybe they're not. Yeah, maybe I should go check that out. Eh, who knows. Alright, well, that's pretty much it. I gotta go do some stuff, so... Daggerfall check up May, what is it, 7th or something like that. That's it, folks. Hope you guys liked it. Have a good week. Have a good month. Have a good year. Peace, folks.